guess what? Torque Storm Supercharger is in the house. So, I cannot stress to you how excited I am to open this box and how hard it has been for me for the past six-ish hours not to open this thing uh, already. So, I wanna get into opening this and talking to you guys about what we're doing with the Supercharger on the Battle Wagon, which if you don't know, it's pictured right there. Truck's full ball ton of cam, um, got a lot done to it. It's making a good amount of power, but it needs boost because it wastes so much. So we're gonna get to putting this on that, but for now, um, I'm gonna open this thing up and let's take a look at it. So, now uh, Torx from Superchargers, they make uh, all their stuff in-house. Uh, they're actually made at a place called Accelerated Tooling LLC. That's the actual company name, but uh, Torx Storm Superchargers. So, excited about this. This is a kit that is specific to our third gen Ram with the Hemi. Uh, it is, this one has the ATI damper, which we'll see in a minute, but if you guys are wondering, the part is ARP dash K dash D G dash Hemi for ATI. So that is what the part number is. I've heard that they do a really good job with everything, but boxing especially, so this could be a bit of a chore. Yeah, here we go. Let's get this one out of here. Oh, it's heavy. Whatever's in here is heavy. This might be the super soldier. I don't know. Oh, man. Okay. I have no idea what is in this box. We're gonna go from top to bottom and check it out. So, I'm gonna put this one on the ground for now. All right, box numero uno. It says, some numbers on it, right there. STD, don't know what that stands for, 3.5. So, I'll explain to you what the 3.5 means in a minute. I mean, you may already know. And this is good for the channel. Let me tell you, you guys, if you're not subscribed and you're just watching this to see what a third gen Hemi kit looks like, because there's no other videos out there, I would definitely subscribe because we got some things coming to the channel. It's really about to take off. I've freed up some things in my schedule. So, YouTube ought to be better than ever. All right, box number one. Yeah, well packaged. Oh, it was what I thought it was. Man, I am excited. That is absolutely gorgeous. I bet you guys wanna see what I'm looking at. This, is a Torx Storm Supercharger. Man. Oh, man. Yeah, that is sweet. Okay. Um, I'm going to set this on the table. I don't think there's anything else in here. I'm going to set this on the table, and we're going to open up that box, and then we're going to go through each one of these things. So, uh, yeah, for now, set this beauty down nice and easy right there. Oh boy, this box is heavier than the other one. Get me out of here. All right, so box number two. I really want to look at that, but we're gonna we're gonna do this the right way. Okay, box number two. And by the way, just to clarify, if I didn't already state this, it's for third generation Hemi's. Uh, on in a third gen ram so third gen ram with the hemi 57 so uh that would be 2002 or no 2003 up until 2008 uh and there may be some crossovers in there but that's going to be your standard stuff for that okay oh man 
What do we have? Yeah. Oh, this is a goodie box right here. Like that's the present you were wanting. This is stuff that's around it and stocking. And this is stuff that you really wanted to make that thing work right. Okay. This is a little diagram. Kind of shows you how it's laid out. Looks like uh, there's a little spacer maybe. Um, tells you which belts. They circled which belts you use for the pulley. Which that 3.5 is the 3.5 inch pulley. We went with that and I'll explain that later. But okay, little instruction deal. Nothing major. Get on Christmas. Okay. What do I pull out of here first? I have a belt. Belt. By the way, I know I said this, but it tells you which Deco and which is this one and which Gates belt to buy right there. So awesome job, Torque Firm. I don't have to call you and bug you and ask. I know you guys are busy. This looks like the crankshaft pulley that will operate this. So I'm gonna set that down and we'll look at that. Um, okay. Let's wait, let's got some stuff on top of it. Crank pin kit. So we've got to uh, drill our crank and we'll go over that in the installation video, but we have to drill the crank so that the crankshaft pulley that's driving this doesn't spin on the crankshaft uh, when it starts building boots. So, awesome. Not sure what's in here, we'll go over that. This looks like a SMB filter, which I thought that they used K&N brand filters. Uh, it doesn't really matter because there's no air box that goes around this. Uh, but I thought that they used K&N filters. If you guys go back and watch this video, Right here, which is not as exciting as this video, but you should go watch it. Uh, we put it on an SMB cold air intake, uh, and that was way better than the K&N, but that was more of a design thing than an actual filter thing. But I'm wondering, we'll look at this uh, and see how it looks, because they're using SMB filters now. Let me move that right there. Okay. Uh, we've got some, looks like some stuff for the blow-off valve, maybe in there uh, v-band no that's not a v-band clamp that's just a regular clamp um, bunch of hardware okay couple brackets one bracket two bracket then I'm right there, running out of space on the table, you guys. I'm gonna have to move this stuff to where you guys can see it, but we'll do that in a second. This is our crankshaft bolt. Nice. Set it down right there. All right. Bracket three. So this is where the supercharger is gonna hang off, and there's a tensioner pulley. That. Wow, we're gonna unbox this. We're gonna unpackage this in a minute. That is impressive. Wow. I waited a while for this. I know you guys waited a while for this. Until the last video last week, you didn't know what we were gonna get for the truck. And I hadn't explained just told you all that yet. But it's actually been ordered for quite a long time. Um, but the world is a crazy place these days. So no issue there. Glad to have it. Uh, this is an ATI damper. It's an upgrade to the kit uh, that you would want to add if you're serious. And if you're buying a supercharger, I sure hope you're serious. Worth the money, you guys. Worth the money to upgrade from your stock one to this one when you do this. It's part of the kit. You can upgrade to it. Makes things a lot better. Some spacers here. And a manila folder. All right, I'm gonna get this stuff laid out on the table. That's the unboxing, that's everything. Here we 
we have. And the next thing we're going to do is take each and every one of these things out of the packages. And we're going to look at them and talk about them. And, and there's certain things that I picked for reasons that were optional. And you could choose what you wanted to do. And I'm going to explain why we did that and why I'm going with that. What the plans are for the truck going forward. And other things coming up.